man. That balloon pop show, man, with the uh, alpha male guy on there, man. He really, he really shows you how a real man is supposed to express himself. He wasn't disrespectful and like that. He, he was just letting them know that I'm not, a, I'm not gonna be walked over. I'm not gonna be walked on, and that type of thing. So he was giving off them vibes more than anything. Um, but the lady at the end, she liked him. You know what I'm saying? She, I think she liked his energy. Um, he, you know, I think he was feeding off the energy that he was getting. I noticed that he looked him in the eye. When he was looking him in the eye, you know, when he was looking him in the eye, he, if he sensed that they was about to attack, then he said something. He let two of them go. You know, he gave him a pass. He didn't really come at them like that, but he was just letting them know, like, don't look down on me. If you don't like me, I don't like you as well. So he gave some of them a pass. But, um... That's how they don't want guys acting like that. You know, that's not how they want guys to act. They don't want that level of masculinity and intimidation. They want guys really scared. They want guys, they don't want that level of masculinity, um, you know, like that. They want a guy that's broken down, you know. They want a guy that's, that's walking with that level of confidence, you know, that he had. Even though he was short, he was confident. You know, but they don't like that. You know, them the type of guys that I was, I was, you know, that type of energy I was raised around, them type of guys, brothers, uncles, all the men. They had men like that back in the day. You don't see too many men that carry themselves like that, confident like that, you know what I'm saying, uh, and willing to um, stand up for themselves, you know, and whether in any situation, in any circumstance, they're going to stand up for themselves. Um, you know, not being uh, ig ignorant, but just being um, defensive. I mean, not not insecure defensive, but meaning that if you're going to bring it, you know, be, be careful how you bring it because I'm not just going to let you hit me with, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to be a puncher bag for you. You know, so I think he handled himself respectful um, because the ones that was nice, he was nice to them. He asked, he said, when the girl bring that energy back, he said, he said, uh, he said, I, I, I got hair on my arm, so I popped my balloon. He was like, well, he was like, well, uh, he said, no, nah, it's all good, because he liked their humbleness, he liked their energy. He was like, you want the balloon back? And no, uh, she said, no, nah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. But he was like, but he offered the balloon back because he was like, it ain't, you know, it ain't like that, you know. I was just bringing the energy they was bringing to me. That's what I was giving to them. So that's all that, you know, he was just letting her know, but she didn't want the balloon back, but he still, and he still won in the end. He got him, you know, the, the, the nice looking 23 year old at the end. She liked him and she wanted him and they, they went up out of there and other girls were shaking their head like, wow, you know. So it's always somebody out there that's gonna like you. You know, you guys gotta understand that. There's always somebody gonna like you out there, but um, I'm Alan Regionaire. Make sure you check out my, my, my main page at Alan Regionaire Live, but make sure you subscribe to this page also with the like button, subscribe button, notification bell button. Follow me on Instagram at Alan Regionaire Show. And uh, much love to y'all. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. We out. Also, uh, I got three I got three new singles out. Uh, one called Do the Congo by Alan Rayonaire. The other one called is Projection by Alan Rayonaire. And the other one is called um, Frequency by Alan Rayonaire. All right.